हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी वुड बी लर्निंग अबाउट माई स्क्वेल सो लेट्स स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द बिगनिंग सो फर्स्ट वी हैव टू एक्चुअली मेक यू डेटा बेस क्रिएट अ डेटा बेस सो लेट्स क्रिएट अ डेटा बेस फर्स्ट सो लेट्स गिव इट सम नेम एज डेमो अंडर स्कोर टास्क सो डेटा बेस इज क्रिएटेड नाउ सो लेट्स चेक वेदर अवर डेटा बेस इज क्रिएटेड और नॉट सो वी वुड यूज दिस शो डेटा बेस इज so it will show all the databases present over here so this many databases are present and demo task database is created create database demo task okay so now let's create a table so for creating table you have to write create table let me take it later up create table table name let's make it prod prod underscore one and we have to create so let create columns so let's be product id so product id and we have to give this int and we have to define its rate type so i have defined it as id uh, id as integer and then product name let's say p name and we we would use as var car for characters okay for uh, it's, it's uh, like a string and we would use till 233 the <coughs> uh, that's like the limit of it 233 and uh, okay here yeah, we have to write int 11 actually it's like this okay and p name va as varkar as a, it's like a string so we use varkar varkar in this and let's use product name then product uh, type so let's make it as type and again varkar 233 as it is a string uh, i guess that's enough and let's so what's the no database selected so we have to select the database so use what what we have created the database okay we have created database as demo task so use demo task okay so yeah we have the uh, database has been changed now so let's use this okay this query has been work now let's see let's say description of that table so description of <coughs> table name so it is prod1 okay so description is this sp product id is integer and default is null varkar is uh, product name is varkar that is string and varkar is like string in mysql and product type is varkar okay we have created create table and table name and we we have created col column names over here okay so it's like pid p name these are the columns so let's see let insert some values in it so insert we would use insert into for this insert into table we have to use insert into uh value in this uh insert into is used to for inserting values inside it so for description we have to use desc and the table name okay and we we can use alter for alter alteration of the table and uh <coughs> so let's insert into table name what's the table name it's like product 1 insert into table table name okay actually it's like insert into table name and we have to use values okay so values it's like this insert into product 1 and what's uh, what is it it was p id can look at over pid p name p type so we have to write it over here pid comma p name comma p type okay and what are the values of our it we have to write it correspondingly over here so let's uh, let's take the values what's pid let's say it is 1 0 1 okay and what's p name product name let's take it as watch watch 
and let's the product name as uh, we'll say product name as watch and let's uh, let's say it as Sonata Titan something like this Titan so it's watch and product uh, type is watch okay and let's let's see whether it works yeah it works so let's see it's well let's see the table whether it, it has inserted or not it has been inserted or not so for that we have to use select star star means universal means it will select all columns star from which table in product prod prod underscore one that's the table name of it see the values has been inserted over here pid 101 p name titan p type watch okay for creating database we use create database and database name for creating table we use create and we have to use that database so you have to use use that demo uh, da database name demo task we have to for creating table we have to use create table table name and we have to give the column names over here okay and for inserting values we use insert into table name and then we use the column names and the values here correspondingly we could add many values uh, inside it like using this using suppose we are using 102 um, 102 and let's take it as some sonata let's take it as watch and uh, suppose we have to insert more values so we use comma and then we could use that use it like this insert into comma so let's take it as you can use uh, a apostrophe single as for your double apostrophe whichever you you would like suppose like like a mm, hero hero bike name okay product type is bike whatever so we have inserted two rows okay we can have multiple values also and in the, this way we can use single values okay so now let's see uh, once again select star from product one from product table so it has given that value as pid okay p p the three three values have been inserted over here so now we can use alt alteration we can alter the table so let's alter the table suppose select star from product one is a these are columns they're all columns star means all columns pid p name p type suppose we just want that uh, product type or product name so we what we would write select select product name that is a column name that is a column name from which table from prod underscore one which we have defined so now it will just show this columns okay if you write star then all columns will be uh, selected and shown okay so now let's use alter table alter 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 table this is like uh, what if you want to alter something over here uh, suppose you want to change the table name so we use alter table that's like the keyword alter table alter we which with alter we could um, uh, like rename the ta ta table name and then we can modify all that things let's do one by one uh, alter table and its table name is product one so prod underscore one okay rename we would rename to uh, suppose like product underscore one we have renaming it to product underscore one so query has been okay so okay so let's see that this is working or not select star from product one product underscore one yeah see this uh, table name has been changed let's see the tables over here show tables using show tables we get to know how many tables are present so there are in table in demo task that is our database name demo task product one this table has this table is present product one we have just created one table so it's product one okay we have renamed to product one now suppose you want to <coughs> change column name okay uh, let's change pid or p name which column we will change uh, let's change p type okay to it category 
okay so again we using by using alter we could do this alter alter table alter table product underscore one product underscore one change column what's the which, which column we have to change p type okay so p type to uh, we have alter table product underscore one change column p type suppose we have to change it to category category let's see it's error it's showing error at near near this uh, at line one okay alter i guess we have given some space over there this is, this is the alter table product underscore one change column p type p type to category let's give it as let's define data type also let's see whether it works or not yeah it works now see we have changed its column name okay from p type to category we have to uh, write the database data type also which data type it is then only it will show so let's again see select star from product after writing again and again then only we will remove this so it's better you keep writing it so let's see see over here we are the column name have been changed now from p type to category we can go we could even see description of it description describe dsc and product underscore one so you could see where type it's varkar and all that it's a column name has been changed now we could even drop the table so first let's create a copy of this create table so create table let's make it product demo demo underscore one select just for <coughs> cloning that table cloning this table we have we will write this okay so we are cloning this table so that's why we are writing over here it will clone this so exactly you will get this all table values and data structure of it so this is this is cloning of this table product one table okay so a new table will be created demo underscore one with the it will clone the, it will clone this product one okay so let's see the tables show tables we could see this yes you can see over here demo one is being created so let's see what's its description is it the same describe demo desc demo underscore one so it's the same over here let's see its values if we can see its values select star from demo one see it's same demo one zero one one two three all that okay now suppose we have to de delete delete the table so what we will do if suppose you want to delete demo one demo underscore one okay so we will use the drop drop keyword drop table demo underscore one what it will do it will de delete the table okay so let's see its query is okay so now let's see the tables how many tables are present over here show tables so it's one product one okay which it was demo underscore one and product underscore one now we just product underscore one we have dropped the table drop table demo underscore one okay uh, this was the cloning of the table okay this uh, where it was gone you just you clone the table by using create table 
demo one demo underscore one and just we have written the query of it select star from okay we have cloned that so now suppose we have to drop the database we can even drop the database using drop database whatever the database name is okay and suppose we are trying to truncate now let's see truncate uh, again we will create say we will clone the table again same way create table <coughs> demo one okay let's see show tables so again demo underscore one table is created what does uh, truncate do now we have dropped the table the delete the table using drop drop table table uh, table name okay demo that's a demo, demo one so it has dropped that table <coughs> deleted that table so what does truncate does so truncate will uh, let's even see mm. select star from demo underscore one what it is gives it gives all this okay so now what does truncate does let's see truncate table table and that is demo underscore one okay so its query is okay so now let's see again select star from so now you can see that the table is present so let's see the description of it if there's no values inside it okay if you can see over there, here there was values but after truncating that table that values have gone so let's see description of that table demo underscore one so description is the same data structure of a table is present but its values have been truncated so that's the difference between truncate and draw drop in drop we delete the table in truncate just the data values values are uh, deleted but that table structure is present way okay <coughs> So we had used insert, we have used truncate, drop, now and we have used select. Select is like the most common thing we does, we do every, every time. And suppose we want to modify, okay. Uh, let's modify, uh, let's alter table uh, demo underscore one <coughs> <coughs> demo underscore one let's add column let's see add column column name and that so price of it let's see price add column price int uh, uh, let's retrieve be int and its maximum limit let it be 11 so alter that table table name add column and column name its query is okay so let's see the description again description demo underscore one so yeah your table column has been added price okay so alter table demo one add column this is this is one of the important query because we sometimes we have to add also columns so all that okay we have added the column uh, by using change we have changed the name where, where it has written <coughs> here alter table change column p type to category okay this is also very important so let's change column uh, instead of change we can i guess we could even use modify let's try that also alter table table name demo underscore one modify column 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 name let's uh, modify category again to p type and uh, let's make it varkar actually modify is used to change the data type mostly mostly we used to changing the data type let's see whether it even change the name or not let's see if it does or not no it doesn't so let's change the data type if you want to change the data type then only we use modify suppose we want to make it as int okay so now let's say desc 
demo underscore one okay so now its data type is int okay did you got that but we <coughs> for just for changing the modifying the type we use data type we use modify and for change changing the name we use change column old column and column name okay change column <coughs> old column name to new column if you want to change let's let me write it then you will get it better again i'm doing it again okay alter table if you want to change column name then what we will do alter table table name that is demo underscore one change column column name that's old column name is category category new column name is let's define as p type and var car we keep on writing then only we will get that so it's better you keep on practicing all this thing var car 233 <coughs> so let's see over here <coughs> column name is changed okay change column name column name is changed <coughs> uh, now let's update some records mm. okay let's some update some records so we have altered alter we have used alter we have used select we have used dropped modify and all so insert also we have used insert into tables let's modify so let's select star how many tables are there first let's see show show tables demo underscore and product. so select star from product underscore one <coughs> okay <coughs> suppose we want to suppose we want to just uh, update some records so for updating we use update <coughs> update column name that is product underscore one update column name and then we have to set uh, what we have been it's like update set where you can remember that update set where we use these keywords for this okay so update column name set update table name this product one update table name update table name that is product one okay update table name set column name set <coughs> column name that is uh, suppose we want to change this set uh, p name hero to something <coughs> honda set column name that is set p name equal to honda where what is id where pid equal to 103 okay i guess we could even use comma over here and set suppose <coughs> column name category equal to vehicle just for understanding i am using this so it is yeah it works okay so we could use uh, multiple also or single and for multiple you have to use comma okay so let's check select star from product underscore one so look over, look over here from hero it has turned to honda and from bike it has turned to vehicle okay it has update okay so we have done the update also so <coughs> now let's delete the record okay where is also a keyword okay so from where it's like selecting a common row okay from pid equal to 103 so it got selected via 103 and then it had has set all this value set column name to hero to honda <coughs> and set category to vehicle okay hope you got that if you haven't got that keep uh, keep uh, listening to it you will get that slowly slowly so let's de delete the records some delete some records from here so for deleting we use delete 
delete some records so these are the records is the rows and uh, rows the there this all are the records we can delete single records also by using delete from where like update set where these are the keywords so for the delete could use <coughs> <coughs> sorry for delete we can use delete from product let's table name delete from table name <coughs> table name where like delete from table name where okay this is the keyword you have to use delete <coughs> where id uh, suppose i want to delete honda so pid from where so p id equal to 103 <coughs> so where is okay so let's see whether it has deleted or not so select star from product underscore one you could use up arrows for this okay for changing this you could use up arrows or down arrow okay so select star from underscore so here we can see you could see this we have the <coughs> our record is deleted okay uh, we have used alter select and uh, update <coughs> uh, now <coughs> now let's see where clause <coughs> uh, I will do it in the next next part so thank you for uh, watching for this now go for the part 2 I will do give you start over there okay thank you so much